Fight the good fight of faith, holding on to your confession. 1 Timothy chapter 6 and verse 12. Fight the good fight of faith, lay hold on eternal life to which you were also called and have confessed the good confession in the presence of many witnesses. Paul is reminding Timothy that he has confessed a good confession before many people. What is this confession? You know, many times we think about confession as, as confession of sin. But obviously Paul is not referring to confession of sin here. He's talking about the confession of Timothy's faith. He says, Timothy, fight this good fight of faith and you hold on to eternal life, which God has given you, and you've been called to this. And he says, holding on to this fight, to this faith, because you have confessed a good confession before many people. That means Timothy has openly declared, openly proclaimed what he has believed before people. And Paul is saying, you know, you fight the good fight of faith and don't go back on the confession which you have confessed before many people. The things that you have testified to, the things that you have spoken of, uh, the promises of God that you have uh, spoken with your own mouth. Now don't go back on it. Fight the good fight of faith. So here's something we must learn as we fight this good fight of faith. We must learn to hold on to our confession. What we have said about God, what we have said about His Word, what His promises that we have believed in and that we have attested to and which we have proclaimed with our own lips, we have to hold on to that confession which we have confessed before many people. Or like the writer of Hebrews says in Hebrews 10 and verse 23, he says, Let us hold fast the confession of our hope without wavering, for he who promised is faithful. That word hope there means expectation. It can also be translated as faith. And he says here, you hold on to the confession of your expectation. What you have said will happen. What you have said will take place. Hold on to that confession. What you have spoken with your mouth concerning what is going to happen. He says, because God is faithful. The God who promised is faithful. So in fighting this good fight of faith, remember, you've got to hold fast the confession of your faith. What you've confessed before many witnesses. Don't let go of your confession. Keep declaring God's good word. He is faithful who promised. Let's pray. Lord, we ask you that you will empower us to hold fast our confession of faith. Because you who promise are faithful. In Jesus' name. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.